Hi guys, I'm back. Um, now we're going to show you how to prepare your windows prior to installing your film and also preparing your workspace around you. So um, we've got your window here. Um, we now have to um, pull back the curtains and move any of um, your furnishings out of the way. Um, tie back your curtains if you can. Just make sure that, you know, because you're going to be spraying water around, it's only soapy water, it won't really damage it. Um, that you have some drop sheets on the ground. You can see the blue one here that I've got, which will soak up any excess water that might flow down. Um, we're lucky here that the flooring is tiles, so that doesn't really matter. But if you've got carpet, you want to make sure that you put some coverings down. So we've, we've done that. We're looking at our window here. Um, check to see if there's any stickers or any excess silicon. Um, check the, um, the edges of your windows. Some are silicon, some are have a rubber. So just make sure the rubber's in properly because if it then goes, gets moved once you put your film on, you're gonna have a gap around the edge. So this is all looking really good. Um, like I mentioned before in the, in the, the first video, that this is flow glass, so we're putting on a, a safety solar film. So first of all, we're just gonna use our mix um, DIY home tint you can buy a soapy solution that we send out to you. So we'll spray the, the window here first, putting an even layer of spray on the window like this. If you've got a big window like this and it's you know it's reasonably warm outside, just do half of it to start with. So um, six inch triumph scraper blade, they're um, double sided so you can swap them in and out, very sharp so just be careful here, so let's turn that over to get a fresh start here, put that back in, 6 inch scraper blade, really good for large win windows, you get through the job a lot easier, so I mean we do have the smaller more budget kits, if you've only got small windows they'll be fine, but if you're doing a large window like this, Pay the bit extra, get a big scraper blade and you'll get through your work much quicker and easier. So let's start from the top. Angle your blade about 45 degrees like this. And start from the top like so. Getting any paint, old paint specks or um, you know, mold is often on windows, especially on aluminium framed windows. Covering your stroke over by at least 50% and, and going over it again will ensure that you get every mark off the glass. Being methodical and just working your way down so you don't have to go back up and check on what you have done. So door handle's a little bit more tricky but just angle your blade in like so, hold your hand back so you can get right in there. Look at the glass as you're doing it because sometimes if you just go over it, you might skim over something, so you might have to go over it again. A little bit more water. If you're doing DIY window tinting for the first time, try to do it when there's not too much sun on the glass. Um, so if you've got a west facing window like this one, do it in the, in the morning and um, you'll have more time to get it on safer without damaging your film. All the contamination has, has been scraped and it's running to the bottom. And I'm looking, scanning the glass as I'm cleaning it to make sure it's thoroughly done. Now at the end here, you just flick out the bottom like that to get it off the glass. So we've scraped the window and we're happy that the window is clean. So Make sure you put your cap back on your six inch scraper blade so no one gets their hands cut. Grab your spray bottle again with your soapy mixture in it. Spray your window again. Like 
like so. And then get your squeegee. Um, put a little bit of paper towel. This is your common um, household towel. Like that. Have that in your other hand ready to go. So here's your squeegee starting from the top. And the idea is to collect all the water and bring it down the glass. Like so. And what I do is stop there and then I wipe excess off straight away. That stops it coming down straight away like that. You can see there's a bit of dirt or mildew that's um, built up on the rubber, so you're getting rid of that straight away to stop it running back into your glass area, which is going to highlight anything when the film gets on it. So you use as much, much of this paper towel as you like. You know, it's cheap and it does a good job getting any excess water or dirt away from the edges, which is the main part of cleaning the window. So we start off again here like this, squeegeeing down, back and forth, and bringing the squeegee down. So you don't leave any water up here, you're bringing every drip of glass down, no, drip of water down the glass. Come down, come down like this. So, getting your paper towel, wiping all the frames all the way around. Paying a little bit more attention to where the door handle is, because obviously the door handle's in the way and not as easy to get to, but just slow down and, and pay a bit more attention to that and you'll, you'll have a better result. Get a fresh one, keep keep getting more towel here. Don't be afraid of using another piece. You're gonna go through a few pieces on the bottom because obviously that's gonna have more dirt and water than the rest. So I'm happy with that, that's pretty clean.